Okay, let's go there, squirt. Oh, we go. We're putting the other side today. Thumb's not falling so good. Let's go. Come on, let's go, bump. Let's go. So this last pair, I had a little bit of work to do to it, nothing major. But what you're gonna see is, we got a tag on here. Not wanting to hold still very much, but it's a white tag, and it's, it says 15J on it, and, huh, and she walks in like that. Here, we'll trip. see if we can do it better now. And so she's got that tag on her, and we're gonna put a different one on her. A, we like our tags all yellow, just that way it's easy. And the other thing is, we also have a 15J in our record keeping. So cows that we buy from Peter Panner, what we've been doing is adding a three in front to making a 315 in this case. And then the Anwender ones, we've been adding an eight in front. So if you're wondering a little bit of our rhyme to reason, it's just for our computer program, for helping us keep track. Duplicate numbers don't work unless you put pronouns and whatever. So we just change the number slightly. We will have this as a reference. So if we ever need to go back, um, we still know which number it was that we bought from Peter. So this here little tool, we use to take the tags off. It's got a double sided knife, works really good. You'll see I'll stick it behind the ear and it's just one easy motion. Should be, it'll come off. There. So mom's got her new ear tag. There are guys that what they'll do is they'll just add another one, they're at one to it. But what I'd like to do is take the old one out and then we can stick the new one in the exact same spot. That way we're not damaging the ear. We're literally putting it in the existing uh, hole. Now, the other thing we have to do is I believe this guy's gonna have horns. Yep, so I've got to put some dehorning paste on him. Slash her, sorry, her. And that way we don't have surprise horns in a couple months. Uh, Hello, my dear. Okay, so what we gotta do is, stuff we use is Dr. Nailers. Uh, and what I gotta do is find the little bud. You look really comfortable. Okay. Uh, it's gonna be right there. As you can tell, I put gloves on because this stuff is uh, a little hard on the skin. Okay, that hopefully does it. So most mums are like 315, where they do a good job of waiting for the calf and then they slowly walk them out. But uh, this little guy here, Hannah's calf, she kind of, how does one put it, nicely. Uh, she got left behind, so mom must have been hungry or something. I'm going to have to keep an eye on that one. Hey, let's go. Keep going, girls. All three of you. Let's keep going. I'm going to go do some calf checking. See how everybody's doing.
Hey, everybody is just kind of chillaxing here. Basking in the sun, if you will. This is what I love to see. Of course, I come here and then it wrecks it, but with uh, this little calf had its head in there eating with the cows. Can't beat that. Okay, so we got bedding all done. And those with a couple cows lying here. Mostly, I think we're just uh, enjoying life. These two here have both calved. And no, that's not true. The black one is calved. And these two are just, the other two here are just relaxing, but we do have at least one, I think two that are calving. This one here is uh, my niece uh, Haley, or Kendall's daughter. It's uh, her cow is calving. And then there's this one who's Dylan, my son. And I got a feeling it's in the beginning stages here too, so. We'll see here. Yeah, they're both calving. Okay, so while I was gone, Haley's cow calf. Peter says it's a little bull calf. Everybody looks good. Peter, you said you had to help it a little bit, eh? Uh, you didn't have to, but you just did. Uh, I did a little bit. I got it made her get up. And... Oh, yeah. Gold card's definitely calving. Her uh, bag is out. Here, you got that pill? This is the last tag that we have, and then everybody is tags. This is I'm looking for. It took us a little bit to uh, figure out which one it was. You don't have to bother, just jump. Well, if you want to go in there, Peter, that's great. We had two calves that were moms were kind of a bit confused about. Other than that, the rest of them worked out pretty good. But so it took us a bit longer, but we do have it. Yeah, let her out. So let's just do this quick. This shouldn't take us too long. Get on it and... I don't want to grab it. It could... Oh, right here. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Where's my foot? There. 
Thank you. Let the moat. Everybody is tagged, labeled, and ready to go. That's exciting. Here, Peter, I'll let mom out and then we'll boot these ones out. You got that? Okay, Quinn, I'm gonna get the. I'll get the door for you. That pair goes out. Where'd that last? Where'd that calf go? Oh, good. I was worried I sent it out, but you kept it in. Out of boy. Hey, we gotta put this one. This one then needs to go a wild card. Can this one go outside? I think we're gonna keep it in tonight, at least until later on. And then I'll boot it out maybe after I come back later on. Okay. Tags are all on, and we booted Haley's calf and cow out because it's actually nicer and I believe healthier outside for them. This one, the guys, Dylan's wild card cow, the guys had to help it a little bit. And so just because of that, we're gonna leave it in here till at least supper time. It has been on, we've seen all, both of those calves have been on. And so we're good that way. Just wanna keep an eye on this one for a little bit. And Hannah over here earlier on took off with her cow. This calf's calved a couple days back, but uh, she took off and left the calf behind. So we got to make sure they stay together. So they're going to stay in here for tonight yet. And uh, we'll see what hopefully tomorrow everybody's doing better and then we're good to go. So um, yeah, we're going to have less cows in here tonight just so less mess. Warm outside. So the only thing we're bringing in. These two heifers are our closest to. They're gonna come in tonight so I can keep an easier eye on them. And other than that, that's what we're doing here for tonight. Chances are, if there's anybody calving, it's gonna be outside, but I'll be able to check that from the camera and we can deal with that when it comes. So uh, again, it is beautiful weather here today and uh, a lot easier on the animals. So that's for right now. We're done, tagging's done, and it's supper time. So that was a big job. The boys' idea of bringing the calves all into here was an awesome idea. They did that while I was gone. And I got myself a haircut, got myself a little prettied up. And, uh, and uh, now we're good to go. So yeah, it's supper time. You guys ready to go for supper? Yeah. You're sitting on the job again. We're watching TikToks. You're watching TikTok. I'm watching <laughs> I thought at least you'd be watching YouTube. No. Just TikTok, eh? feminists on TikTok. <laughs> All right, ready to roll? Yeah. Let's go for supper. Of course, now that we are got the camera on, oh, there it goes. Beautiful sight. As we're about to walk out, this calf goes on, Mom. So we know it's on again. That's a bonus. Oh, must not be super hungry. Okay, supper time for us.